Yo, what is up guys? Kansas Marvel here, back at it again with another LEGO DC Super Villains video. Alright guys, so today we're going to be making the Barbarian from Clash of Clans. So yeah, this is another troop from the game, uh, in case you guys didn't know. Uh, and yeah, man, I think it turned out pretty good. Um, I do think the Hog Raider probably turned out a little, a little bit better than this one, but I still think the Barbarian turned out pretty cool. He looks like, like the Barbarian, which is, you know, probably the most important <laughs> the most important thing when it comes to making these customs. But yeah, man, um, I'll, I'll probably be doing some more Brawl Stars, maybe some Clash Royale. And probably I'll probably still be doing some uh, Clash of Clans stuff because I can still do like the Archer, maybe maybe the Giant um, and some other troops as well. So yeah, man. Um, let me know if you guys like, end up liking this custom, and if not, that's okay. But without further ado, guys, let's go ahead and get started with this one. All right, guys. So first things first, you want to go over the head and go over the head again. All right, now the head the head that I use for the Barbarian is gonna be uh, custom, custom head number yeah, it's gonna be custom head number seventeen. And then you want to go over to the facial decal color and you want to go ahead and make it yellow because he does have like a yellow mustache. Uh, next, you want to go over to hair, and for the hair, you want to go over to the flat top. Now, he actually doesn't have hair. The Barbarian doesn't actually have hair. It's more of like a helmet. It's like a yellow helmet, but this is really like the closest you're going to get because his helmet kind of does look like hair. It's just like flat on top and everything, so it's not exactly the same piece, but it, it's somewhat similar, so I think it works. Uh, for the body, you just want to go over to body and go over to the custom one and go over to custom body number one. Uh, the, the, well, actually, first, what you want to do is go over to, to uh, the Bane body, actually. Yeah, because if you want to make the same skin color as his head, you have to go uh, over to the Bane body first, and then click on that, and then go over to the body you want to use. It's kind of annoying, but it works, so yeah, it's, it's, it's annoying having to do this, but it's, it's, it's alright, I guess. Alright, so for color number two, you want to go to make the lions black. Alright, so now on to the legs. So for the legs, um, now the Barbarian, much like the Hog Rider, he does wear like a skirt, <laughs> and then like some sandals. So I actually found a pretty pretty good piece that I actually like quite a bit for this hog rider. And it's actually a, or not hog rider, this barbarian. It's actually uh, Lashina's. And then if you go over to color and change it to brown, it actually looks really good. The only thing that kind of bothers me is the the blue there, but it doesn't even look that bad honestly. You know, I really like the way that he has like the the shoes there or the sandals, the brown at the bottom of his feet there, and then you can see like the upper part of his legs are like brown. You know, which is which I like a lot. I think it looks it kind of looks like he's wearing um like a kilt or skirt or whatever you call it. <laughs> and then he's wearing like obviously you know boots or sandals or whatever you wanna you wanna imagine. All right, guys. So next for the hips. Uh, so for the hips, I actually used um, I used Detective Bullocks because um, the Barbarian does wear like a it's like a belt with like a, a silver shield in the middle. So I think this works out pretty good because it does have a little bit of gray in the middle. And then you wanna go ahead and make it a dark red color because his belt is like a dark red. Uh, next for the hands, you wanna go ahead and make sure they're the same skin color as his uh, his body. And then for the arms, you wanna go over to. Uh, for the arms, I believe I used um. Uh, okay, so it's gonna be it's gonna be down here somewhere. Yeah, so I used Death Storms. Now um, he does wear like some brown like bracelets around his wrist, uh, but uh, but unfortunately we can't really give him that. So I decided to go with the uh, Death Storms, and they have like the black black uh black thing around his wrist there, which looks pretty good. It's not it's not brown, but it it still looks it looks all right. All right, guys. So that's pretty much it for our barbarian. Now just let's go over to the hidden pack. So for the hidden pack, I went ahead and made it yellow. <laughs> Uh, for both the hidden pack and the jump slam effect, just because it matches his hair and stuff, it looks pretty good. Um, for the now moving on to personality, so for the personality or the health icon, uh, we're gonna go ahead and make it yellow. The health type, make sure it's standard. Voice, make sure he has male voice. Star reticle, um, I think Enchantress is probably gonna work good because it has like the stars, you know, the yellow and white stars, which just match him. Uh, normal uh, speed, normal, and for the animation style, normal as well. All right, guys. So on to the weapons. For the weapons, uh, you wanna go over to. You can either go with a, a gladius sword or a short or a long sword. But I decided to go with the Gladius because the swords they actually use, like the tr these troops in, in the game, um, they're kind of short. Uh, they kind of look short anyway to me. But if you guys prefer like the way the long sword looks, you can go for that. But I'm gonna go with the Gladius. And for the color, you want to go ahead and make it uh, like a, a silver gray color. It's probably gonna be yeah, it's gonna be this one right here, the darker gray. Well, that's the one I like anyway. But you can go with the, the lighter one if you guys want to. All right, so now I'm gonna skills. So for X, we'll leave it off. Or for whole triangle, we'll leave it off. For X, we're we'll going to give him a double jump. Now this character is probably not gonna have too much in terms of like powers and stuff because he, oh, he really all all he really does is like like uh, hit stuff with his sword. So yeah, it's not 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 too complicated when it comes to this guy's abilities and stuff. All right, so now on a square, so the tap square, um, we'll leave it blank for hold. We go ahead and give him a lunge. Yeah, we're gonna give him a lunge. Actually, you know what? Should we give him destroy mode and then give him? Yeah, we'll give him destroy mode for hold square. So we will go with style number. Yeah, so I think style number three looks pretty good because it kind of kind of suits the barbarian. You know, it's like a. Very crazy wild attack. Yeah, we'll go with that. Alright, so for circle, for tap circle, I think we'll go ahead and just leave this one blank as well. So yeah, nothing for that. But for hold circle, we'll go ahead and give him a lunge for this one. Yeah, we'll go with lunge down number... Um, we'll go with lunge down number two. 
And then for skills, like I said, he's not very too he's not too terribly like complicated when it comes to skills. So he's not gonna really have too much. So we'll leave grappling off, technology off. We'll give him acrobat, no mind control, no telekinesis. We'll give him wall climbing, smash walls, and super strength. Now he probably doesn't have like super super like human strength, like the Hulk or whatever. But I'm pretty sure he's strong, you know. Uh, for being in Clash of Clans anyway. <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll leave Chlorokinesis off. Uh, beam Deflect, I guess, with the sword. Uh, no Goon Command, no X-Ray, no Graffiti. Uh, no Tracking, because he kind of, he's kind of a dumb character. Uh, no Hazard, uh, no Illumination, and no Stealth. Alright, guys, so that's pretty much it for our Custom Barbarian. Now all we gotta do is take him out to the Metropolis hub world and showcase him around for a bit. So yeah, man, as you can see there, I have the, the Hog Raider as well. Uh, without the Hog, unfortunately. Uh, but I don't know, I might go to Smallville and get the, retrieve the hog, but probably won't, because that's just going to take too long. <laughs> and yeah, like I said, guys, I'm, I'm going to be making some more uh, Raw Star customs and uh, Clash Royale, maybe. And definitely some more Clash of Clans, because I can still do, like, the Wizard and the Archer and maybe Giant and stuff. But yeah, guys, here he is, right, custom uh, Barbarian in LEGO DC Super Villains. And yeah, man, I think I did a pretty good job, honestly. Um, out of the two, I'd, I'd probably prefer the Hog Rider, especially if he's on the hog. He, looks just, he just looks so much cooler. But I still think the both turn out pretty good, um, you know. For, for what I was able to do. I think it turned out pretty good. So let's go ahead and go over to the, uh, the streets over here and see if we... Uh, should we go to, should we go to uh, Smallville and see if we can get a hog for the hog raider? Yeah, I guess we will. Why not? <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead. I wonder if I, if I steal the cop car, will they chase me? Yeah, okay. That's kind of funny seeing a, 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 a barbarian in a car. <laughs> But yeah, man, I'm pretty sure if I, if I try to make the wizard, if, I, if I'm able to make him good, he's probably going to turn out really cool. The wizard, like, besides, like, the Valkyrie and Hulk Rider, is probably one of, like, the coolest looking troops, I would say. Or he's probably one of the coolest, especially if you have him as, like, a high-level uh, wizard, like, level 7 or 8. I think there's a level 8 wizard. I'm not even too sure. I haven't actually, like, uh, I haven't played the game, or I haven't played uh, Clash of Clans um, in a while. Well, yeah, I haven't played it, basically, in a while. I do log on every once in a while, but I just don't play that much. Alright, so the hog is going to be somewhere over here on the farm. So let's quickly get off this car and uh, go over there. Uh, let's see. Here it is. Yeah, so the, the, the pig usually, you know, just hangs out over here in the meadows and stuff. The cornfields or whatever these are. <laughs> I wish, I wish, like, if I, I could, like, switch over to the Hog Raider, or should I just, yeah, I'll just switch over to this guy, and then, uh, when, when, once we get into town, I'll switch back over to the Barbarian, and then we'll see if we can get the cops on us. I don't know, man, I just really like the way <laughs> this guy looks on the Hog, or on the Pig. He looks, he just looks so cool, you know, he looks like the Hog Rider, uh, from Clash of Clans, it's kind of funny. Yeah, man, I, out of the two, I would definitely say this one's probably my favorite. I like both of them, I think both of them turn out pretty cool. But yeah, man, I just really like the way this Hog Rider looks. I just, I do wish, though, that I could turn into, like, a, or I could still have the hammer. What the heck? Why is he punching me? What did I do to him? Let me get him over here, barbarian. <laughs> Boom. So I, I believe we gave him a lunge, right? Or actually destroy mode? Oh, okay, now I know why he attacked me because there's something here in this. Uh, what, what's in here? I'm pretty sure there's nothing because it doesn't mark anything on the map. There might be a gold brick there, but I, I don't think so. I don't know, I'll, I'll probably, I'll see what's in there after I'm going to record this video. <laughs> Let me try to destroy mode on one of these cops. Uh. Let's try it again. Let's try it again. Man, this doesn't even, this doesn't even do anything. Okay, never mind. It does, it does destroy them. That SWAT guy doesn't want to go down, though. Alright guys, let's go ahead and uh, go up here and end this video. Alright guys, so that was the vid video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it and liked this custom. Let me know what you guys thought of this one down in the comment section below. Um, if you guys have any suggestions on more, you know, characters you guys you guys want me to make, leave, leave, leave them down in the comment section below and I'll take a look at them. But yeah guys, stay tuned for lots more cool stuff coming soon. Thank you all so much for watching. Have a great rest of the day guys. Take care. Peace.